Welcome to Med Seekers. In this video, I'll be talking in detail about CUET PG 2024 latest official syllabus, which is released by National Testing Agency. 2023 syllabus pattern is different from 2024 syllabus. So make sure you download latest syllabus and prepare accordingly. There are different codes for public health. Different codes are having different syllabus. So make sure you check the appropriate code and download the syllabus according to the code which you have ticked in the application form. So in this video, I'll be talking in detail about COQP19 syllabus. In my upcoming videos, I'll tell about other codes and how to prepare for that. In this video, I'll be specifically focusing on the code COQP19. How should a student prepare for COQP19? Which books will be best for their preparation? All this I'll be discussing in this video. Before diving into today's video, if you are new to my channel, I welcome you to MedSeekers. I post all the educational content related to medicos, paramedics and public health professionals. Do consider subscribing to channel if it's helpful for you. If you are interested in today's video, do hit the like button. This is my Insta ID MedSeekers9. This is the official syllabus released by National Testing Agency for COQP19. So your question paper will have 75 questions and all the questions will be subject specific and all the questions are compulsory. You'll have questions in bilingual English and Hindi, whichever language you are comfortable, you can choose that. Coming to public health syllabus, we have basic microbiology, biochemistry, biotechnology, epidemiology, social sciences, food and nutrition, communicable and non-communicable diseases. They have clearly written prevention and prediction public health and epidemiology. So this is your syllabus. Coming to your most commonly asked question, books and preparation strategy for COQP19. In the earlier part of this video, I have talked about what is your entrance exam syllabus. So based on your entrance exam syllabus, I'll be telling you standard textbooks for each particular topic. Coming to basic microbiology, there are two standard textbooks. One is C.P. Baveja, the other one is Anant Narayan. You can refer any book whichever you are comfortable in. Content is same in both the books. Author style is different. So whichever book you are comfortable, please refer that particular textbook. Don't buy two textbooks. It will be of no use to you. Buy any one textbook. Coming to biochemistry, we have the same two textbooks. Satya Narayana and Vasudevan. Whichever you are comfortable, you can buy that book. Coming to biotechnology, we have Satya Narayana. Before going to public health part of syllabus, See, if you are from non-medical or non-biological background, please read class 11 and 12 NCRTs so that it will have, you will have a basic understanding of biological concepts. And when you are referring standard textbooks, you can understand it very well. Coming to public health part of syllabus, we have public health epidemiology. We have epidemiology, social science, food and nutrition, communicable and non-communicable diseases, biostatistics, environmental sciences. All these will be covered in KPAC textbook. In your entrance exam point of view, PSM by Dr. Vivek Jain, which includes biostats, will be a good book for you. It has practice MCQs also. KPAC is just like a Bible for preventive and social medicine. Concepts are beautifully described in KPAC in detail. These two are standard textbooks for public health. Whichever book you are comfortable, please refer that book. I'll drop all the book links in the description box and comment box also because many students are commenting for book links so that it will be helpful for you. If so far this video is helpful for you, do like the video and share it with your friends who are preparing for CUET PG MPH entrance exam 2024. This is my Instagram ID medseekers9. I'll be posting all the public health updates and all the information related to masters in public health entrance exam. If you are interested, do check it out. If so far this video is helpful for you, do subscribe to the channel and click the bell notification for all the latest updates. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.